been extremely successful. Cinematographer and drone pilot Douglas Thrawn is talking about this, his highly outfitted drone, one he uses to help rescue animals after natural disasters. I got the idea to basically put an infrared camera on the drone and that way when the ground is cool, you see the heat signature of the animal. I've also mounted spotlights on the drone, so it's almost like a police helicopter. And then I also have a 180 times zoom lens so I can see the condition of the animal. We first caught up with him in the Bahamas following Hurricane Dorian. A lot of times these animals, they're hard to reach, they're hard to find, they're scared, and time is very critical. It was the inaugural use of his infrared drone. The important thing about the infrared drone is it shaves off so much time. You can save so many animals so much faster that it should be getting used on every one of these disasters. Word of Douglas's success quickly spread. He and his drone have now been to numerous disasters. From Dorian to California for wildfires, Australia, where he spent about seven months, to Louisiana for Hurricane Laura, back to the West again for wildfires and more. It's basically been nonstop since I started this about a year and a half ago. And I've been on the road, um, thankfully through donations or different wildlife organizations. As a result, he's rescued or located hundreds of animals using this technology with no plans to stop anytime soon had to you know feel like it was actually making a difference if I'd meet people that had just lost everything and to be able to give them back to their pet I mean that's that's pretty huge the technology works so incredibly well I hope to inspire other people to do this sort of work because there really needs to be dozens of people like me doing this